Okay, we're ready for our first run. We're starting in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Just below us is probably a new FIA world record breaking truck. I say probably, but we're just about to find out because there it goes. Fantastic speed. We're chasing it in the chopper. We can't even catch up with it. The current FIA World Land Speed Champion for a truck is Swedish truck racing legend Boye Overbrink. And he did his record in 2012 with a special hybrid truck called Mean Green. Well, now he's out to break his own record in an even meaner creation. This beast, the Iron Knight. The Iron Knight has been custom built for one goal alone, performance. Its 13-litre mid-mounted Volvo diesel engine has been given an enormous boost, which results in 2,400 horsepower and 6,000 newton metres of torque. Together with the original iShift dual-clutch gearbox, 0 to 100 kilometres an hour takes just 4.6 seconds. If you want to be an FIA World Land Speed Record Breaker, you've got to work to very strict rules. In the case of Iron Knight, it has to set that record over a thousand meters. Not once, but twice. Here in the background, our track's coming. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so in 2012, Boyer set his own record. What have you done to make this better than Mean Green? Unbelievably, this truck is a thousand kilos lighter and we have 600 horsepower more. We've pretty much taken a standard gearbox and packaged it into this fantastic piece behind us. We're talking about lightness, we're talking about power, we're talking about a world-class gearbox. So all the signs are pointing in the right direction. <laughs> okay, let's clear the course, let's clear the runway. He's got to break the record across one kilometer. Exactly, and one kilometer. And he's got to do in it- In both directions, right. within the hour. Okay, we're ready for our first run. We're starting in 10. Nine, eight, seven. So it's quite simple. All Boyer has to do is drive like fury to the end of the track, stop, turn round, and come back again. And if it all goes to plan, we'll have a new world speed record. Three, two, one, go! And there he goes. Look at the power. He's really moving down the track, it's been accelerating like a bullet. I've never seen anything like it. It's the first time I've been overtaken by a truck in a helicopter. The first time is in. The time is 21.33. The current world record time to beat, averaged over two 1,000 metre runs, is 21.596 seconds. So here we are at the start of the critical second run. This is the one that will really know whether he's broken the record or not. OK, second run. Everyone stand by. And now he's beginning to pull away from us. The power from that machine is just phenomenal. Well, it looks fast to me, but you never can tell. We're just peeling off and we're going to go round in a circle and catch up with him. The time is in for the reverse run. The time is 21.24. He's set a new world record. He's done it. He's set a new world record. The old world record, 21.596. He set himself in Mean Green and Iron Knight has smashed that record. Volvo Trucks The Iron Knight is the world's fastest truck, beating the world land speed record at both 500 and 1,000 metres. Oh my goodness! <laughs> <laughs> With The Iron Knight, we actually don't only want to build a fantastic looking truck, we want to show our customers that we do enthusiasm. We do the same quality and the same precision that we put into our products back into a showcase vehicle like this. 
a series produced hero is hiding within the drive line of this fully customized truck the ice shift dual clutch gearbox so to beat this type of uh, world record we need a transmission that can shift without power losses power shift gear changes our uh, ice shift with dual clutch is of course a uh, perfect transmission for that. We haven't changed anything, but we needed to update the clutch to handle the torque that is 6,000 Newton meters, and that is a lot. The feeling to drive this one, it's, uh, it's a big go kart with a lot of power and good handling. Besides the iShift dual clutch, the Iron Knight is equipped with a modified D13 engine with 2,400 horsepowers. The truck is a testimony to what Volvo Trucks engineers and designers can accomplish when given complete creative freedom. It really has been a labour of love, this project. The Iron Knight is basically a truck where we said to our designers, think out of the box, and that's exactly what they did. They took all the DNA and the elements of today's FH, but strengthened everything. We sent that truck down the gym. It really does look like it's on steroids, I'm afraid to say.